Greetings everyone, this is Shai with you and today we are going to be looking at the spectrum chart. Okay, now the chart okay on your screen right now is uh, the nifty spot and uh, we are looking at the spectrum. Now, How do I get this chart? Uh, from the menu, uh, if you click down NF option strike uh, spectrum, BN option strike if you want to choose uh, bank nifty, this is okay where bank nifty would be, the bank nifty spectrum but uh, for the purposes of this video let's uh, stay okay with what the nifty is though okay what i mentioned is going to be the same so first and foremost this is going to be off the spot and uh, you have a number of options open so let's uh, go through them you can look at this uh, pane below and uh, let me just deselect all of them so we have a clear vision of what we are looking at right now this is the spot chart and uh, because okay we like to look at what the futures are also doing the future premium is also added over here now to this this is okay what we call the spectrum okay now the spectrum is represented by these blue lines and you can run it across a number of days though we li like to ask you to focus okay on the image two days but you can run it okay for the entire uh, weekly cycle as well right now this is okay what uh, the spectrum is showing now to put it simply the spectrum is nothing but the inventory of the market now a lot of traders when they look at these lines and they have this mindset okay that uh, lines are meant to be support and lines are meant to be resistance we'll walk a little bit further away from that line of thought and what we want to demonstrate through the spectrum is where current positions are built in the market and working out of a concept called uh, the gamma the second order greek uh, we like to estimate a probability of a high and a low a probable high and low based on the exposure of those option traders in the market okay so this does not mean okay that this is resistance or support but the expected range uh, of all the traders of all the big traders who are placed large positions in the market this is going to be denoted by these prices so currently it's about 17100 on the higher side of and 16800 on the lower side and this can change as inventory of participants uh, keeps changing so again i like to repeat uh, this is a uh, a measure of the existing inventory of players and the spectrum is actually okay projecting a high and low of that uh, project of of that inventory which is there in the market the gamma zero is the neutral position which is there and generally the belief is if price is uh, staying below the gamma position the writers are comfortable uh, it could happen that uh, price okay could go below these gamma levels also which means that inventory is uh, going upside down at that particular instance of time so when it does go a couple of things okay can happen mostly mostly okay we have seen uh, that uh, if inventory is uh, is caught upside down by the movement of markets uh, generally okay price does retrace and this is uh, uh, generally I mark it in uh, inverted commas generally price does retrade uh, giving market participants a chance to readjust that positions but when it moves down okay it does tell you okay that the market okay wants to go down even further and inventory of the position is moved lower so the best way okay you could use the spectrum chart uh, as a writer of options is uh, you could understand the bias of the market in 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 the case of this chart it's uh, easily understood that the market is drifting lower so you could use the upper spectrum line okay to write some positions or write some call positions in the market and monitor the price okay around this uh, spectrum level which is about 17100 if you are an aggressive kind of trader trader you could also use the gamma zero reference and write positions around that and uh, keep an eye if the market okay wants to stay above the gamma zero level okay uh, you could okay write it as a range also uh, you could write a uh, 17,100 16,800 as a range also but then uh, that is okay meant for 
very aggressive traders in the market and you need to keep an eye at all times to ensure okay that the market is uh, is responding and you have the bias of the market uh, right at all times right now there is another element okay to this uh, which is the market with high and the market with low uh, simply put okay this is what we call the market visualization um, high and m with low is market visualization low now these yellow ones okay would be represented by those lines and they are a mark more of the intraday activity which is uh, happening happening in the markets so whenever okay you see that this uh, m with uh, low is trending lower the market uh, is getting adjusted to the lower side i'm not saying okay that the price is gonna move lower over here uh, eventually okay price follows the positions of traders in the market but uh, the market visualization tool is there to tell you that traders have adjusted inventory in or adjusted positions in the market and are, 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 are anticipating a downslide and anticipating a fresh low in the market so the market visualization goes lower at around 210 to 15 over here and the market okay starts dipping lower from a sideways kind of a bracket right so keep an eye okay out on this uh, yellow tool as well this works perfect okay for the intraday uh, trader uh, if you don't want the futures premium you can just click out on this and uh, this is uh, done out the futures premium anyway okay comes back to zero as we move into the last uh, settlement of the month uh, but it's just for us okay to let know okay what the futures are doing right so it's up to you okay what you want to focus on i would suggest okay that you keep the the gamma levels also high this tells you okay what the market is thinking of in terms of the larger weekly settlement or the larger weekly expiry here you have an option of choosing the number of uh, days okay of the series and you can see it's fairly consistent in terms of what the traders are expecting the market to do right so this is the spectrum chart i hope okay you use it okay to the maximum possible uh, uh, advantage this has got some high level uh, greeks okay in built into it and uh, a lot of okay visualization added uh, using okay some premium okay tech okay which we've developed at uh, we trend so i hope okay you found this useful any questions you have uh, please direct them to charts at vtrender.com